Yo, what's going on guys? It's Deku back on the Madden 16 and you guys see man on your screen We got some new positional heroes Rashad Jones and that's gonna be the first one we hop into so you guys see Rashad Jones right here on the screen now You guys are going to see the wild card and you know all that good stuff that you need to complete the set Got the wild cards out the way first now. I'm guessing This cam chancellor is going to be the big money maker in the set. You know the card that just is generally going to go for a ton let me check out this Rashad Jones too uh, I also didn't check out uh, the Iloka card either oh okay so it looks like Jones doesn't go for too much now we're just gonna go check out this Iloka I, I really haven't seen any card in this set that like just goes for a ton so like if you guys can, can comment down below and maybe help some of the people checking out this video yeah this will hill doesn't go for much either like, I, I went through the set, and maybe it's just because, you know, it's like the first day it's up that, you, you know, like, no card is really going for a time. I guess this positional hero card and that camp chancellor are going for a grip, but you guys get what I'm saying, man. Now, once again, I apologize if that was poorly worded. I am on no slate, but we also have Weston Richburg on your screen right here. Now, I actually had no idea that the Giants had, like, a monster center. I really thought I thought the Giants offensive line was bad, but you guys see the wild card cards getting those out the way. Travis Frederick and Nick Mango. Now, <laughs> when I got on today this morning, I was I was psyched because okay, Mango doesn't go for much. I was so geek because I was like, yeah, Unger and Pouncy in the set. Boy! Like nobody could tell me nothing, right? But that's not the case. That's not the case. Like, just like these Frederick and, and this Mango, like they don't go for too much either so i'm guessing just this position hero collectible and you know maybe i should start doing these sets i could probably turn a profit i mean even the collectible to say the set's been up like just like an hour or so it's not that bad to do the set okay here we go here we go now we looking now now we cooking so it looks like this rodney hudson is going to be the hella expensive card in this set now, I'm also sure there's probably some gold cards and whatnot that will go for something. Maybe one of these guys. I'm going to check it out real quick. All right, yo, let's get it. We got Rich Bird. We got Mr. Rich on the screen right here. Richie Rich. So, I just got done checking this set. I, I checked the gold cards, and I saw none of the gold cards going for a crazy price. But I love these positional heroes. Like, if for nothing else, the card art is so fucking dope. Like, the card art is love. 93 strength 67 agility 75 speed 88 acceleration 99 impact block a 96 pass block and a 95 run block 95 awareness though homie might be you know kind of clutch picking up some of those gap blitzes i'm not sure awareness factors in and you know picking up those blitzes that confuse the ai but you know i like to think they do up next we got rashad jones man you guys knew it was coming though you guys knew it was coming Rashad, yo, man, Dolphins fans, I don't think y'all gonna let me live it down if I don't get a gameplay with this card. Because you guys have been wanting me to get gameplay with the Dolphins player for the longest, and I was like, ah, I do it. But the card, I just, I don't feel like this card does him justice. 400k for this guy, that's, that's kind of absurd. I mean, 93 hit power, that's, that's dope. But 88 zone coverage and 86 play rec, 91%. This is supposed to be. I'm guessing an aggressive in the box kind of safety, but you know has some coverage ability too. Well, his in the box stats just aren't that dope. Like, I mean, don't get me wrong. Like, I I'm telling you guys, man, the car looks cool, but I'm just not like OD geeked for this Rashad Jones. Now, Dolphins fans, yo, don't hate me, man. I'm sure some of you can back now. The 89 block shit, that's amazing, and, and the 88 power move and the 76 finesse move. Like, don't get me wrong. That's really cool. But like the rest of the card, it looks like, you know, just another cool safety card. All right, guys, for your troubles, we are going to pull three pro packs. You know, just something light. Just because you guys have been so good to me lately, let's see what we're going to pull out of this pack. That's right, guys. Yo, golden tickets are in packs right now. Do I think I'll pull one? I'll have to say my answer is you never know. You never know. You got to shoot to score. So that's what we're doing. We're, we're checking up half court heaves right now. Trying to go for a golden ticket. You know, maybe a boss card. Consolation prizes aren't the worst things in the world. 
sleepers right here. Here we go, man. <laughs> I'm wild when I get no sleep, man. I'm sorry. Like I told you guys last time, I got no sleep. Go to sleep, man. Get your sleep. It's so good for you. It's right here. We end up with a Joseph Randall. So I hope you guys enjoyed the quick video, man. Much more Madden 16 Ultimate Team will be coming out soon. Be sure to subscribe and leave a thumbs up if you guys enjoyed it. I'm D. Coop. And I'm out. Now, you guys see the Calvin Johnson set on the screen, right? I'm not even a person that, like, normally flex like that. But I'm sure y'all know what that means. Now, guys, we did it. But all in all, more importantly, I did it. No, but seriously, Calvin Johnson and Des Bryant.